Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and this is a uh, quick little video to explain a update to um, all of you that are on the October 2018 update. So if you're on the uh, latest version 1809 of Windows 10 and only the latest version, you have received a update that is really just bug fixes. So, um, you know, we had Patch Tuesday this month. Last week there was um, updates for or older versions of Windows 10. And uh, yesterday um, in the afternoon, late in the afternoon, there was a release of a cumulative update for the latest version of Windows 10 that fixes uh, many, many uh, problems. Um, Microsoft Edge freezing, depending on the display drivers, um, addressing issues of third-party applications that have difficulty authenticating hotspots, issues with uh, the Active Directory, um, date format in Japanese stuff, um, compatibility issues with AMD R600, R700 display chipsets, audio compatibility issues with newer games, um, audio playback to stop responding when, when uh, playing some uh, flack or f uh, free lossless audio codec content. Um, what else do we have in here? Prevents users from uninstalling applications from start menu uh, when group uh, policy is set. Address an issue that causes File Explorer to stop working when you click on Turn On button for the Timeline feature. Um, they have local experience pack problems with the language when it's already installed and you're trying to install a new updated language pack. Bluetooth headset problem that's fixed. Um, what else do we have that's uh, interesting? Some compatibility or losing IPv4 connectivity when IPv6 is unbound. Um, a few things like that. And uh, Hyper-V problems remote desktop service problems, and um, pretty much uh, all of this, including rendering um, characters in Microsoft Edge. So all sorts of little bugs that are fixed in here. If you have issues, if you had issues with Edge or issues with Windows 10, uh, latest update in general, why not um, get this update? You go to Windows Update, click on the updates, and there you can go to uh, check out if you have it by uh, going to the win version. Win ver, uh, command will tell you what version you have. You should be at 17.763.292. And the update that's rolling out to you uh, is the update that is KB. Uh, if we look at the um, update history here, uh, KB4476976 for uh, 1809, of course, um, available. There was also a uh, cumulative update for .NET Framework that was pushed at the same time um, yesterday for uh, all of this. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and thank you for watching our videos.